Good morning. Today we are heading to a therapist that specializes in neurological issues. And here's my Uber, my husband, who is toting me around so selflessly. And here we are in the therapist's office. I have not asked if I can actually record in here yet. Um, maybe I'll work up to that and see if she'd feel up to it. Today was our first day here. It was great. I'll give a recap later. Stopped at Chick-fil-A. So there's these new chorizo egg cups that they have. I do not recommend them. They were a little mushy and I wasn't feeling it. But I had to get something in my system because they have me on so many steroids. I'm starving all the time and I'm eating all the time, which is not necessarily a good thing. So I will give you a few videos of me testing out some things the therapist asked me to practice. So first I have to walk heel to toe, straight forward in a line. This is a challenge as you can see. Walking heel to toe requires a lot of focus for me. It is very difficult for me to do. The heel to toe walking I find is easier when I look at the ground, but of course, for the purpose of this exercise, I'm not supposed to look at the ground. So here you'll see me looking because I feel like it's the only way I can get this accomplished. And of course, it's super, super a super slow um, process as well. The next exercise was to cross my arms over my chest and close my eyes and do the same thing, the heel to toe walking straight forward. For some reason, this is just difficult just to even start. Like the very first step is hard always. And it's hard for me to feel where the foot is landing as I'm walking, so I'm obviously not doing heel to toe. I'm walking crooked, side to side, stumbling. This one was hard. It's also frustrating because it seems so simple, but the way the therapist was discussing with me today made me realize, you know, taking away the visual aspect with my eyes closed it just magnifies and makes it more difficult so the last one was walking forward while turning your head side to side so that was fun to watch it is frustrating to see it is pretty much just aggravating because you feel like you should be able to do these things. Walk, walk and move your head. Walk with your eyes closed. Simple things that are difficult. So it's not fun. But this is part of the reason why I'm doing this is I need to see progress and I need to see effort being made and I need to see improvement happening. So when I first started to look on YouTube to hear other people's stories, there really wasn't a whole lot out there as far as the actual recovery process and the time frame. And that's the kind of thing I want to share because I think it's needed. And I think that, I think until you're in this situation, you just don't know. And it's, the unknown, which is hard. So this is day 69.